Good evening and welcome to Compline or an order for night prayer on Thursday the 4th of February when the church commemorates the life and witness of Gilbert of Semperingham, founder of the Gilbertine Order. And Gilbert died this day in the year 1189. Compline is coming to you tonight from the United Benefice of Holy Innocence and St. Mark in South Norwood. You are very welcome from wherever you are joining us. The Lord Almighty grant us a quiet night and a perfect end. Amen. Our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. Most merciful God, we confess to you before the whole company of heaven and one another that we have sinned in thought, word and deed, and in what we have failed to do. Forgive us our sins, heal us by your Spirit, and raise us to new life in Christ. Amen. O God, make speed to save us. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Alleluia. Before the ending of the day, Creator of the world, we pray that you with steadfast love would keep your watch around us while we sleep. From evil dreams defend our sight, from fears and terrors of the night. Tread on the foot or deadly foe that we no sinful thought may know. O Father, that we ask be done, through Jesus Christ, your only Son, and the Holy Spirit, by whose breath all souls are raised to life from death. Amen. Our psalm for tonight is Psalm 16, and the refrain is, The Lord is at my right hand. I shall not fall. The Lord is at my right hand. I shall not fall. Preserve me, O God, for in you have I taken refuge. I have said to the Lord, You are my Lord. All my good depends on you. All my delight is upon the godly that are in the land, upon those who are noble in heart, though the idols are legion that many run after. They drink offerings of blood I will not offer, neither make mention of their names upon my lips. The Lord himself is my portion and my cup. In your hands alone is my fortune. My share has fallen in a fair land. Indeed, I have a goodly heritage. I will bless the Lord who has given me counsel. And in the night watches he instructs my heart. I have set the Lord always before me. He is at my right hand. I shall not fall. Wherefore my heart is glad and my spirit rejoices. My flesh also shall rest secure. For you will not abandon my soul to death, nor suffer your faithful one to see the pit. You will show me the path of life. In your presence is the fullness of joy. And in your right hand, our pleasures forevermore. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. The Lord is at my right hand. I shall not fall. Give to us, Lord Christ, the fullness of grace, your presence and your very self, for you are our portion and our delight now and for ever. Amen. Our scripture reading tonight is from 1 Peter 5, 8 and 9. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary the devil is prowling round like a roaring lion, seeking for someone to devour. Resist him, strong in the faith. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. For you have redeemed me, Lord God of truth. 
I commend my spirit. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands, O Lord, I commend my spirit. Keep me as the apple of your eye. Hide me under the shadow of your wings. And now for our Gospel Canticle, the Nogdimitis, also called the Song of Simeon. The refrain, Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people, a light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people Israel. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and shall be forever. Amen. Save us, O Lord, while waking, and guard us while sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep may rest in peace. As we come to our prayers of intercession this evening, we pray for the people of St. Catherine with St. Bartholomew in Bermondsey, for Egerton, their priest in charge, and today is also World Cancer Day, so we pray for peace for those who are suffering from cancer at this time. We give thanks for those who have recovered and who are recovering, who are in remission. And we especially remember those whose cancer treatments have been postponed to give way for those who are suffering from COVID-19. We pray for the bishop priests and people of the Diocese of Amici in Nigeria. We pray for peace in their hearts and lives this night, as we pray for peace in the hearts and lives of Alec and Una, Claude, Helen, Linda, Mick, Jennifer and Reuben here in our community. We pray for those who are bereaved at this time, and for those who have lost loved ones recently, that their souls and the souls of all the faithful departed through the mercies of God will rest in peace and rise in glory. Lord, hear us. Lord, graciously hear us. Almighty God, by whose grace alone we are accepted and called to your service, strengthen us by your Holy Spirit, and make us worthy of our calling, through Jesus Christ, your Son, our Lord, who is alive and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, now and for ever. Amen. Keep watch, dear Lord, with those who wake or watch or weep this night, and give your angels charge over those who sleep. Tend the sick, give rest to the weary, sustain the dying, calm the suffering, and pity the distressed, all for your love's sake, O Christ our Redeemer. Amen. Visit this place, O Lord, we pray, and drive far from it the snares of the enemy. May your holy angels dwell with us and guard us in peace, and may your blessing be always upon us, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. And as we conclude, in peace we will lie down and sleep. For you, O Lord, Lord, make us dwell in safety. Abide with us, Lord Jesus, for the night is at hand and the day is now past. As the night watch looks for the morning, so do we look for you, O Christ. The Lord bless us and watch over us. The Lord make his face shine upon us and be gracious to us. The Lord look kindly on us and give us peace. Amen. Thank you for joining us for Compline tonight as we give thanks for the life and witness of Gilbert of Semperingham. We pray that God will bless you tonight, that you would sleep well and you will be at peace. And if you can, please join us tomorrow at the same time, 9 p.m. for night prayer. Thank you.